From the court to the courtroom, a dispute that started over a spot on the basketball team escalated. I suppose I, I was a little naive. I thought that, uh, you know, that if, if basketball was the issue. 13 year old Sydney Phillips was expelled from St. Teresa's school in November when she was just 12, after her father successfully sued the school to get her on the boys' basketball team. I've got eight sisters, and I've got a lot of nieces, and they, they all play sports. And I just was surprised that. Uh, you know, the, for the hard line on this. Thing. Cardinal Joseph Tobin, who reversed the expulsion earlier this year, says new information caused him to have a change of heart and grant the school's request to deny Sydney and her sister admission for the next school year. I came to understand that it wasn't about basketball, finally. What did you come to understand that it was about? I came to understand it was about the tranquility of a sc uh, scholastic community, you know, a, a Catholic school that had a particular mission that was unable to do it because of, uh, frankly, because of the behavior of the parents. Defendant Scott Phillips says his daughter's denial of admission is simply payback. Because it's in retaliation that we filed the lawsuit. You know, they're blaming us for all the bad publicity. It's not us. It's them. They're the ones who created this mess. All they had to do was let Sydney play, which she was allowed to do, and this would have been all over. But they're the ones who created it. Every day they ask, um, when did the decision come? They want to go back to St. Teresa's. Judge Donald Kessler will make the ultimate decision as to whether the Phillips girls will be allowed back at St. Teresa's school next month. Testimony resumes tomorrow. In Newark, New Jersey, Jessica Moore, CBS 2 News.